it's a challenge. Every day is a challenge. A, a typical day for an usher, I don't actually think exists. When someone arrives, it, it, I should be in front of court, uh, so I'm the first face they see. See, my role as an usher is actually to make them begin to feel comfortable, irrespective of who they are, whether they're defendant, a uh, professional court user or, or a victim witness. Um, it's put them at their ease and explain a little bit about what's going to happen. It, I mean, at the moment I'm covering county and magistrates. So I, I sort of move from covering trials here, we're a trial centre, to covering uh, uh, county court judges for civil and family. But yeah, it's a good team here. They tend to have been together for quite a while. So they all tend to work very, very well together. We've got things we need to do, and they normally start the day before. We prepare for the court, try to understand who's coming in, witnesses, defendants, anybody that we can find some information about. Prepare that on the day before. On the actual day we come in, um, it's to get the court ready, prepare the magistrate's room, re retiring room, prepare the court, check the equipment just to make sure everything's working. We've always had um, video hearings. I've been doing video hearings probably since I started. They were rare then, uh, and out of necessity, they've become uh, more and more useful and more and more used in the court service. And the technology has changed slightly. We now use a uh, cloud video platform, the CVP, to bring people in and out of hearings. And it can be multiple people as well. When that came in, as I've progressed and done a little bit more training and used it more, uh, I've become very confident in my ability to bring people in and out and to solve their problems. So that was a real pleasant surprise to me. The biggest challenge and, and is really the most enjoyable thing is, is at the end of the day, if you've had a, a difficult defendant or, or a, a vulnerable witness who's, who's upset, if you can put yourself across and give them the information they need that they walk out at the end of the day appearing a little bit more calm about the whole situation. It's the challenges that being an usher, witness liaison officer present, and if I was doing a job where there weren't those challenges, I, I would stop. I, I need the challenges. You need a reason to get up in the morning. Um, a raison d'etre, there's a Japanese word, ikigai, which is your reason for being, and uh, th that's what it gives me. It gives me a reason for, for getting up, getting out of bed, and doing something that contributes to society. Things. It's, it's just when, so, when you know you've, you've actually done something that someone's going to remember and be thankful to you for.